Dal Rang ten level four and welcome back to my two you no, know, it's Thursday now, Thursday night live stream of Medieval Dynasty. Where of course today we're continuing on our medieval adventure, and I'm excited. This may potentially be the well, I actually don't know if it's gonna be the last one. Because I kinda do still want to have the windmill now. But but off camera we did unlock the tavern. As well as as the tier three barn so we actually have two things to do today which i'm very excited about now i'm debating on whether or not i want the windmill <laughs> <laughs> uh, like i said last time i was originally intending on ending it probably like last week or earlier this week because it was taking so long to unlock things but then we remember the customization option and bumped up tech gain by a thousand percent. And now we're just going through buildings left and right. And I kind of want to get them all now. <laughs> so we may need a little bit longer. But, oh well. For now, we at least do have our uh, lovely tavern we can build. Which means... Oh boy, moving the cow shed. We gotta do that. I don't want to risk... I meant to look it up if we could just destroy the cow shed and then rebuild it and the cow would be fine. But I forgot. Uh, and I don't want to risk it. So we're going to build a temporary cow shed. Uh, so we can keep our person doing their job and keep collecting milk. Uh, we are in a new season now. I usually wait to do the next season on cam just in case there's an event, but forgot. And thankfully there wasn't an event, so we're on the new day, or the first day rather, of a new season. So we should have some soured milk, which is good, but we need to get more normal milk. And roll from there. I'm excited for the tavern though, oh yay. God, that always creeps me out. <laughs> All right, let's roll. Kind of weird that no one else opens their their uh, shutters. Why does why does my house? Why do the shutters open automatically there, but not here? Huh. Never thought about that before. Kind of strange. Okay. Well, let's see. I've got a pretty good hammer here, so shouldn't need a new one, I don't think, for today. Let's grab the horse. No, oh God, out of my way, Amerigo! And... Oh, he's over here. <laughs> I was about to say, did I leave my horse somewhere else? Oh, wow, he's actually in a stall. Huh, that's unusual. Okay. And Beastie Bunny, my shutters know who's in charge. No, they don't, or else they wouldn't freak me out every time they do that. It always creeps me out. <laughs> I'm just sitting there, you know, doing my thing, and then suddenly those things open, and it's just creepy as hell. Alright, so let's grab everything we need for the cow shed. Well, not everything, just we'll grab a lot of stuff. So we're definitely going to need some other things that I'm not remembering, and we definitely won't get all the correct stuff. Alright, so let's grab some stone. I think it's like, oh, I don't remember how many for the foundation, but should be probably around 12 since it's a larger building. So we'll grab uh, that... Oh boy, we're going to need a lot of stone today, too, for the Tier 3 barn, because that is a stone building. Magnificent. Uh, I don't remember what the roof... I should have I should have looked at the cow shed. What was it all, all was made of? Is it a plank roof or a thatch roof? I don't know. We'll just grab logs. <laughs> Alright, we're going to need probably... Yeah, we'll grab that much. I'll put the logs into here. There you are, my friend. Ooh, forgot to put those into storage before the season change. I always forget to do that. Ah, dang it. I had a 100% meat tart, now I got a 50% meat tart. Dang, alright, oh well, what are you gonna do? And, let's see, Jay, I've been sort of paying attention to the D&D mess going on. Oh boy, it's been a mess. And came to the conclusion that the only way to solve this is to separate D&D from Wizard of the Coast. Ha! Good luck with that. <laughs> and Chartreuse, did they open up the shutters when you installed them? Maybe they just stay in that state they start in? I mean, well, no, they always start closed and then I open them, but I don't know. I don't know. All right, let's go out here and build a temporary cow pen. Get it. Okay, so hammer out. Building. Animals. Kill shit. Here we go, just right by the road. Beautiful. <laughs> oh, only ten. All right, neat. Okay, so that's easy enough. 
Cal will just be wandering around on the road. Ooh, I should check if there's bandits over behind here. <laughs> Don't want my cow wandering into a bandit camp. Oh, I... <laughs> I forgot I put the... I forgot I put the logs into here. Also, why do we have five things on the, um... On the list up at the top of things we need and management? Oh, no. Oh, no. What What's happened? Oh, it's all stick. Yeah, it's stick and thatch. Now I'm a dang fool. Alright. Let's get that. That. Nope, didn't need you. You need a log. You need a log. You need a log. You need a log. Good, good, good. Okay, I need a crap load of sticks. Got it. Okay, let's go. Well, first, let's check management. Why? Why is there five? Why is there five? Okay, now that, those make sense. And what? What? <gasps> oh no! Oh, we had so oh, some people gave birth. <laughs> Crap! <laughs> Dang it. Oh, no. The hen house is without people. Wait, also, why is there an animal icon next to it? It's saying no worker and no animal, but I guess because there's no worker, it's just... That's just the generic thing? Huh. Huh. Well, I think that's the thing causing the issue. There's something in production, too. Oh, the kitchen. Oh, yeah, we're out of cabbages. Don't worry. Oh, go. Oh, that reminds me. That reminds me. I do need to move over one of my people from the barn to the farm shed. I'll only move one, not both. Well, I'll do Siegfried there. Send him on over to the farm to start collecting things. Magnificent. Yeah, we had two people had their kids. We had two people had their kids. Ah, oh, boy. It wasn't the kitchen. Where was the other one? I guess it was another building that had multiple people in it. Oh, dang. I don't know where. Stupid freaking people. Oh, I was hunting! <laughs> Wait, one of our hunters? Really? One of our hunters was pregnant? Oh, boy. Well, yeah, there's never anything in those. Okay, so we had someone in cow shed. Oh, no, that's the cow shed we're building. Someone in, in um... The hen house and the hunting area. Oh, boy. Uh, I'm thinking maybe maybe we take one of the other people out of the hunting shed, since we do have four there. Oh, man. All of my, all of my management things are going to be wrong now for building stuff and selling stuff. Because I need to move around some people. Ugh. All these stupid people having kids. Dang it. <laughs> I hate them all. You know, the excavation shed, maybe? Who's Who do we got in the excavation shed? Ransomir. Hey, Albert, you're not that great. Do you do farming? No. <laughs> hmm. 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 Oh, well, I'll just let it be for now. <laughs> okay, okay. I need to go check over here, see if there's bandits back this way. Just to be on the safe side of things. I never remember exactly where it is, but I'm not seeing anything, so I think we're safe. This is usually the camp locale. Yeah, it looks like we're good. No one's out this far. We're fine. All right, let's go get sticks and thatch. Well, straw. Stupid freaking babies. Ah, oh, I swear to God. <laughs> uh, Jacross, loving the Fallout 4 videos and the Skyrim videos, both great mods. Indeed they are. Glad you're enjoying them. Uh, Sci-fi, I don't want to move the beekeeper because I want to make mead once we have the tavern built. <laughs> I want mead... Oh, uh, because that's like the only alcohol realistically we could make with our resources. <laughs> oh, I got some rot. Oh, some of my cheese died on me. No. 
Uh, okay, yeah, all that. I don't know how many six we need. I'll grab like 50. That seems right, right? Right? Yeah, that's good. And st so we got plenty of straw. <laughs> Ooh, don't need that much. Don't need, oh, don't need anywhere near that much. Uh, we might need, oh god, I don't know, 64? That's probably way too much. Yes, yes, I agree, it's probably way too much, horse. And across, love the Fallout 4 videos and stream videos, stream, thank you for the videos. I watch them when I come home from work. Well, glad I could entertain you after a day at work. And thank you for the audio subscription, there's your cross. I appreciate it greatly. Alright, let's finish this up. God, who could I move? I don't know. I don't know. I'm kind of going to ignore the, that stuff right now, actually. I want to build the things. <laughs> I'll worry about management later. <laughs> Ooh, did I grab enough sticks? I don't know if I grabbed enough sticks. Oh, it was the wind. <laughs> the sound of the wind through the trees kind of sounded very... Br oh, hello, you. <laughs> sounded very briefly like a, a siren. I was like, what the hell? Why am I hearing sirens? <laughs> I thought I was going insane, but no, it was the wind howling. Yeah, I didn't grab enough sticks. Dang. I mean, it is a new season. We're surrounded by sticks. There's that wind again. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right. Where? Okay, we got we got plenty of sticks on the ground here, but what I need are yeah ones like you that give the multiple sticks. That's Deadly Nightshade. I don't need that. I don't plan on poisoning anyone anytime soon. <laughs> so far. <laughs> uh, oh yeah, I always forget that the sticks like these don't actually show up when we use our resource vision. Which always kind of weirds me out. Bushes and all do. And like, you know, all, the, all those, but... Not the little sapling trees. Weird. That should be enough, I think. Maybe. Maybe. Possibly. Possibly not. Hmm. And across, is there another Skyrim mod after Warden of the Coast? No idea what I'll be doing after Warden of the Coast, so... Not sure. Uh, I hadn't planned on doing another Skyrim one, though, because, yeah, I just kind of wanted to go to something different. Oh, well, I still didn't grab enough. Oh, dang. <laughs> Well, maybe, well, maybe, no, no, no. <laughs> Dang it. Oh, well, there we go. Okay, we need ten. Ten more, ten more. There's a stick, there's a stick. There's a stick. Stick. Where's the good sticks? The little saplings. Eh, I'll pick up these and we'll be fine. We need 10, right? Yeah, 10. We're good. And stealth could put houses on the outskirts. Could put out houses on the outskirts of town. Just put one person in each. Be a single person district. <laughs> oh, it's just so many. I don't need more people. My problem is I just have so many mothers. It still annoys me that everyone has to be, like, you know, their own mother. <laughs> Give me a building for childcare. <laughs> or, yeah, like someone said last week, I don't remember who, give him a papoose. <laughs> Having all these people unemployed in my in my town, that's what's causing me issues. I got more than enough people for all of my jobs. In fact, I think if we had everyone working, we wouldn't have enough jobs for everyone. But... <laughs> Okay, now let's see. I actually don't know if we can even do this. I just thought about this. Can we move the cow? Open details. Manage assignment. Uh, yeah, send them to that one. That one? Did that, did that just work? Hmm? No. Okay, there we go. Cow is moved. Cow is moved to here. Yes! Okay, now we have to move person to here. Uh, da -da 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 -dee 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 -dee. Open you up. Demir. Go to the other shed. 
There you go. That's a good Nemir. All right. Well, let's go destroy the other one now. Oh, boy. We're up to six things that are going wrong in the town right now. <laughs> oh, boy. All right. Well, let's destroy this. Hmm. Get out to the destruction hammer. <laughs> and I'm probably going to be overloaded with crap. Now, here's a good question, uh, which I'm just thinking about now. I hadn't thought about it a moment until just this point. Huh, what's going to happen to all that feed? Is it going to go in my inventory once I destroy the building? It better, or else I'm going to be super pissed. And I did not get any of the feed. That was like 40 feed. <laughs> oh, you got to be kidding me. Oh, boy. All right. All right. Oh, hello, child. Oh, I need it. Well, let's see. Oh, I need that child to move. Oh, no. Hello. Move a bit, lad. Yeah, keep on... Oh, that's not enough. Keep on moving. I need you not to be here, child. Oh, God. No, 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 no. Oh, thank you for the feather, child. Keep moving. Oh, it's not enough. Keep, oh, keep going, Odo. Whoops, didn't mean to swing at my child, but that happened. Yeah, that's it. Keep it going. Keep it going, kid. Okay, okay. One more. There we are. Thank crap. Okay. Can I fit it here without removing the tree? I don't think we can. No, not storages. Why am I even looking there? No, not there either. Production. Tavern. Nope. Okay. I need a shovel. Oh, I can make a shovel real quick with what we got on us. That's good. And I do have a stone axe. I figured I might in there for just me forgetting to move things. All right. Let's do this. Alright, was worried it might break my fence, but no, we're good. <laughs> Alright, take that, and that, and that, and that, and then... Oh my god, Odo, you're in the way again, you stupid child. <laughs> oh, I hate you. Okay, okay, so for the five, here we go, and... Oh, five. Mine. I'm caring too much. Not for long. Oh my god, child. I need you to keep... Just keep on going. Keep on going. I think they're at a safe distance now. I'm in someone else's home. <laughs> there we go. Oh, no, wait. No. Oh, that, that rock. That rock is what's doing it. Okay, okay. Wait, wait. We had it green for a moment. Where did it go? What happened? <laughs> it was green for one brief moment in time. Oh, there we go. Oh, that's too much. Oh, and that, I can't go forward. Why can't I go more over this way? I can't, okay, you know, that's fine. Is it fine? It's a lot further back from the road than I want, but for some, it's not letting me get closer. Oh, well. I need more rocks around the corner. Okay, let's get this. <laughs> and sci-fi could move the pigs and put a field where the sty was. Be extra fertile. <laughs> I guess how that works. Alright. And I think we just need seven. I don't know how much I need for everything else, so... Just keep the rest on me right now. Sci-fi. Odo likes to collect feathers, put them in charge of the chickens. Great practice for when in charge of the village. <laughs> By the roots, Odo was the first child, right? You started the the apocalypse. I mean, I, yeah, I had to have my heir. Don't got a spare, though, which is unfortunate. All right. Builder's hut! Oh my god, it's all logs. It's all logs. It's all logs and planks. Oh dear god, we need a lot. Oh my god, we need a whole hell of a lot. 
Oh, it's doing the planks right now. Oh, I just wanted to use my logs. Darn you. There we go. There we go. Oh, 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 oh yep, oh, that's... Oh, boy. Oh, I need a lot of stuff. Oh, God. Horse! We need to grab all the logs, buddy. <laughs> all the logs. Okay. Beastie Bunny put some uh, tables out front, roadside service. <laughs> you know, I don't think we have enough room for that. Actually, I should have thought about that before I started building. Might have been interesting to have like a little place like over in Gustovia, but oh well, don't care. Still need room in the back for the cow pen, so. Or cow shed. Here we go, put that away. I don't need you. Whoops. Did I accidentally grab an animal feed? I did. And the straw. I don't need you anymore. I'll throw you in here too, because meh. <laughs> okay, let's just grab a crap load of logs first. Grab like 40. Yeah, horse, take me. Chartreuse, leprechaun, call the place of ride by drinks. Ha! <laughs> so I make a bit of beer garden, the cow paddock. Noise. All right. Hammer back out. Let's do this thing. Oh, God. There we go. Let's get some of these out of my inventory first so I can move. <laughs> All right. Back over here. Now, I always hate that these need... Each one of those needed a freaking log. Oh, God, and we still have this over here. Oh, that's all logs. Oh, my God, yeah, we need a lot of logs. Okay, well, that's all green there. That's that. Ooh, ba -ba. You up there. Oh, my God, yeah, we need so much. Okay. Will we have enough logs for the bottom area? No. I'm going to need a few more. All right. 714. 17 logs. All right. Grab those. <laughs> 17 logs. My God. We're going to go through so many. Oh, I'm not going to have enough planks, am I? I'm going to have to make some more planks, I think. Jacross, eating cooked veggies with buttered and cheesy pasta while watching the stream. Noise. I made myself some nice, uh, just mushroom pasta earlier for dinner. It was delicious. All right, wait a moment. Wait a moment. There we go. Stamina's back. All right, now grab, like... All of our planks, basically. I'm probably going to need the horse for this. With me! Sci-fi, who's going to be the tavern keeper? Need a new house for a new person? No, no, like I said again, we already actually have too many people in this village for all the jobs. We just have too many freaking mothers. <laughs> I'm not going to get more people. Oh, I'll just move some people around. <laughs> we'll be doing things far less efficiently. I refuse to grab more people. Why am I scrolling through there? No, no, no. I need to be over here. <laughs> uh, Yeah, grab all those. I'm going to need more, I think. You know what? Wasn't as over-encumbered from that as I thought. All right. Let's head on back. You know, considering... Actually, hold on. I just thought about this. Considering how little money my wife actually makes at her stall, because she has the crappiest of their three stalls. Oh, I assume it'd be... Oh, uh, I assume it'd be production because of the making of alcohol. Dang, she sucks at that. All these stupid mothers everywhere. <laughs> oh, why? Why are there so many? Oh my god, yeah, we're gonna need a lot more planks. Hmm. And that, to the other side, too. Why is that 12 planks? <laughs> I mean, I understand this is supposed to be like one of the end game buildings, but it just, it is always 
confounded me at how they calculate the uh, resources for some things. Like, some things will be basically, like, the same size as another thing. Like, this! This! This one little triangle here needs 12 freaking planks. So this little triangle needs as many as that whole friggin' thing. <laughs> Why? What the hell is wrong with these people? <laughs> That's not how construction works. If anything, I could see if, like, this whole archway here was the 12, but 24 for this little pit! It annoys me. Okay, so I need 24. I need 31 planks, so I need to go grab. You know, because I need more planks for the future, I'm certain. In fact, yeah, we will actually for the other barn. I'm just going to grab 25 logs and turn them all into planks. That sounds like a plan. Ooh, boy, there we go. It's still probably not going to be enough for what we need for later, but oh well. Alright, back we go. In sci-fi, it seems the delightful sound of children cavorting is like kryptonite to code bus. <laughs> no, no, it's just, oh wow, what the hell is that cow doing over there? I'm just mad that we have so many mothers not working. <laughs> All right. Oh, God, man. I really actually will need a new hammer. I didn't think I would today. Hmm. I figured that bronze would keep going for a while. Hmm. All right. Well, take a sip of the drink. Okay. Get all of these sorted so we can finish the tavern, throw one of our people into it for the time being. I'm curious about something once we do build it. We'll find out momentarily, but is it only for alcohol production or can it also make food? If that's the case, I might move the kitchen people there. Or at least one of them. Still might keep the kitchen going just to separate things. But yeah, maybe move one of the kitchen people. Oh, one of the kitchen people is pregnant right now. <laughs> Goddamn. <laughs> uh... Alright. Yeah, so if I agree, it would be good if it doubles as a food stall. That would be good. Because, yeah, then definitely I'll move one of my kitchen people over. And actually, uh, Chartreuse Leprechaun, of course she is Yamina. Yeah. I thought she was going to give birth this season, but apparently she didn't. Which is confusing, because she was, like, pregnant. She's been pregnant for a while. <laughs> <laughs> I really would have thought it would have uh, triggered by this point. But apparently no. All right, let's roll. Hammer back out. And... All right. We soon have ourselves a glorious tavern where I assume and hope all of my people will congregate in the evenings rather than just standing around in the streets. And got that. And last bit, we're almost done. We almost have the tavern. Yes. Come on, tavern. Boom. 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 And this also means that the uh, Royal Herald may show up here. He will come here too. Oh, well, I mean, they do have a... Oh, that's the brewing station. No, nah, there's no cooking stuff in here. We got a juice press, wine barrel, and a brewing station here. Nah, dang. Uh, I don't hold out hope for it doing what I'm hoping it's going to do. Alright, let's just close all these. We just have too many things up right now. Production. Tavern. Things. Yep, just all that. <laughs> well, you know what? We actually still do have an excess of food right now. So... Oh, Blanca, you're going to become the new... Whoops, nope, I needed to fire you first. You're going to become the new tavern person. Congratulations, Blanca. And we're going to make mead. Oh, yeah, we need to make bottles. Oh, I didn't think about that. Why is that locked? Oh, I have to unlock it. No, oh, Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> to the tech tree. And a boop, and a boop, 
And, oh yeah, we can make all those now. Mmm, yum, pies. Gotta love a good meat pie. Uh, where is the mead? Where is the mead? Am I blind? There it is. Boom. Also, we're actually going to need to make at the workshop the mead bottles. There we go. Which is handy, because that uses the clay, and we're already making other bottles right now. Uh, what do those actually take, though, resource-wise? Just because I'm not remembering. Just so I can try and figure them out. Uh, the clay bottles there. Use one less. Okay, so the meat bottles use four, these use three. So, over to the workshop. <laughs> and we're making 7.8 of those. Let's turn that all the way down. Screw that noise. And let's make... A five of them? Can we get away with five? Oop, yep, we can get away with five. Beautiful. Well, there we go. What do we put it all the way up? So, it would drain our clay a little bit more. Let's actually bring that down, because, yeah, we're not producing a crap load of clay at the moment. Yeah, so 5.63. So, to the tavern. That's all we'll be able to make with, uh, with that. Ooh, which is a slow process. We might be able to readjust the bottles because, dear God, oh, oh I, just, I was off the button. So we're 5.63, and even if we go all the way, okay, we can do 6.3. Let's bring this down, actually. To, uh, yeah, like five there. Five mead a day. And back to the workshop. Just a little bit more. Okay, cool, 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 cool. Now we'll have mead. We have mead production in our village. Yes. <laughs> oh, and sci-fi, I know. The NPC taverns sell basic foodstuffs, which, uh, yeah, I mean, oh, well, what are you going to do? All right, we got it, though. Yeah. Oh, I need to cut, cut down those trees. I don't know if we're going to be able to fit the cow shed here, even if we do move around stuff. Well, maybe the cow shed stays out there. <laughs> Why am I going that far down? Over here is where I need to be. Cow's just chilling. <laughs> out here, enjoying his best life out here in the wild. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. You know what? Maybe we leave it there. <laughs> oh, oh, and sci-fi. Can we sell it at the stand with the marigo with the dried meat? Probably. I would imagine so. We want to do that when we have more, uh, a slight supply of them going. So right now we got nothing, so it'll just warn me over and over. Yes, we can. Yes, we can. And out of curiosity, oh yeah, it's not going to tell us until we actually have stock. For it. <laughs> then it'll tell us the amount of money it'll make. Fair enough, but cool, 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 cool. All right, yeah, Marigo is going to continue being our best seller. Also, bye bye to you. Well, we could probably so oh, back to the you know back to the things. So how much you're gonna use? Oh wow, twelve. Yeah, no, no. We we gotta stop selling all all of our honeycombs. In fact, oh, I didn't even think about that. We only make like thirty six honeycombs a day. I think so. We could only make three mead. Ooh, well, yeah, first and foremost, go over here. Ooh, I did not even think about that. We're going to stop selling you. Makes sense anyways, because we're going to be using it uh, to make stuff. Uh, to Animal Husbandry. Happy Harry. Yeah, 36. So, we yeah, we can only make three meat a day. Dang. Oh, man. <laughs> We could make a bit more because we do have a stockpile of honey right now, but... So, yeah, let's do like 3.5 right now per day just to get rid of our stockpile. And that means we can lower the clay thing, too. So, 3.47, back to workshop. Do, 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 do. So, don't want to have too many bottles. Yeah, there we go. Nice. Oh, my God. <laughs> Oh, and Chartreuse, do we said how much the tavern sells for? No, we have no control over any price in this game. Not at all. 
Okay. Oh, yeah, sci-fi. Oh, thank you. The food production stuff. They'll drink it if we don't. Oh, thank you for reminding me. Turn off the mead. And I don't assume it's a food item, but let's double check. Just in case. Oh, no, the wine and stuff is. Yep, it is in there, too. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Thank you for reminding me, sci-fi. <laughs> Oh, boy, lovely. Okay, so we got that. Chartreuse, not prices, quantity. I mean, the tavern actually doesn't sell anything. That's what the market stalls do. The tavern is just there to look like a tavern and be the place that is the production of the alcohol. But, you know, actually, I wonder. Oh, my. Oh, no, let's take a closer look at you. I thought that said, let me see what you have. Yeah, no, they, they don't serve as a merchant. That'd be cool if they did, though. Yeah, yeah, you won't. <laughs> I mean, you will. <laughs> <What>? <laughs> yeah, I don't think we've got the space back here for a cow pen anymore. I mean, it would be just so comp- We're just gonna leave that cow out there. I'll fix up this fence later. <laughs> for now, let's move on to the other thing I wanted to do. The barn, a better barn. Yes. Oh, I need water and food. Oh, yeah, and we still have no one taking care of the chickens. You know what? You know what? You know what? Hmm. God, we just have so many... Oh, wrong thing. I need to just... There we go. Ugh. I mean, I'm just gonna let the chickens be for now. What's their feed like? Are they good for a while? I can come in and collect their stuff. Yeah. I'll do that later off cam. <laughs> I'll, just, I'll just handle it myself for now. All right, let's grab a crap load of stone and go work uh, work on the fence. Or not the fence, the barn. Oh, everyone's quitting for the day. We're going to have to check the tavern. Also a good time, though, to check. Oh, I need to make a new hammer. So uh, what do I need for that again? I always forget. Stick and two bronze. Yeah, we'll check the tavern a little bit to see if everyone's congregating there. And... Stick. Got it. A new hammer! Beautiful. Stealth drunk peasants lead to no more to no work and more babies. Uh, probably. <laughs> Sci-fi, now we can expect to see bootlegger carts with racing donkeys. Ah oh, yes, we'll start our very own uh, medieval chariot NASCAR. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy and what was I doing stone yes yeah, stone 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 how much I need oh we got a lot of stone let's grab like that much yeah sure horse let's roll Ooh, sci-fi, there was only one bloke at the seating area. Everyone must be at the pub. I mean, they just got off work. So, you know. <laughs> they just got off work. Alright. And... Do, 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 farming. Barn 3. Oh, yeah. Oh, I'm carrying too much now. I always forget that it gives me all the things when we upgrade a building. Okay, uh, here, have all those real quick, and all of those. You're not going to be happy about it, but, oh well. Alright, let's get all the logs sorted. Log, 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 log. Yeah, we're definitely going to need more planks. Oop, nope, nope, nope. Got that. Got that. I think that's it for the logs. Cool. In that case, because I'm definitely going to need more planks, let's use the rest of them over here. Still probably not going to be enough. We'll find out. And we also did unlock the builder's hut when we were working on the tavern, so that's cool. Not really a building I care too much about, though. Repairing really hasn't been much of a... You know, 
issue for us. I'm stuck in a tree. <laughs> All right. Let's get the planks. Now we can with those. Ooh, we may have enough. We might be just shy. Nope. All right. There we go. And, uh, yeah, we're just going to be uh, just shy of planks. Dang. I'm going to go grab more logs. All right. So, nine planks. Oh, God. Horse, give me the stones. I'll take care of that and then come back for those. At least in the plus, we should have all the stone. I think. Maybe. Ooh, and sci-fi, yeah. A street lantern next to the the tavern and gate might look good. Definitely, definitely. We'll do that next time. All right. Let's get that. Oh yeah, we should be good on this. Beautiful. Then just gotta grab. I'll grab like ten logs. It'll give me more than the one I need for planks, but it'll also give us a small stockpile for the future. Okay, little breath, little breath, and we just barely had enough stone. Oh, thank God. All right, so back to storage. Oh, and right into the building, of course. Oh, oh, jeez. Okay, there we are. Stealth, you know, the ladies of the night usually stand under those street lanterns. <laughs> All right. Hey, we got a tavern now for them. They can go there. <laughs> All right. Put away the stone, the straw. Oh, I did the thing again where I clicked too quick and accidentally took an animal feed. Yep. All right. So I was going to grab 10 logs and let's quickly ride by the tavern to see. Oh, I'll grab 12. Yeah, sure. See if people are congregating there. And we'll go use the woodcutter outside the fence. People! <gasps> yeah! Three. Three of them are. <laughs> Still, though, yay! <laughs> All right. Magnificent. There we go. Do those and back to my water. Mm -mm. Tavern. Oh, did the tavern have a chandelier? I didn't notice. Uh, we'll go take a look at that when we swing back by. By the roots, three people and three meats a day. We turned off the consumption. We're good. We're good. <laughs> Thank you again for reminding me, guys. <laughs> oh, an agreed stealth. It is good to see that the tavern did have lights. I didn't notice the lights, but I didn't notice what it was. Um, I look forward to seeing it. Still wish we could have had the tavern from the beginning of the game like we used to be able to and have, you know, two tiers, but no, oh well, what are you going to do? Stupid decisions. <laughs> what do we got? Oh, yeah, look at those. Neat. I like it. Oh, and of course, our uh, while everyone else had their quitting time, the tavern lady, she's still there. And only one person at the tavern right now, actually. Huh. Interesting. I'm wondering if there's a range where people won't use it for. So I wonder if only these people in these houses are using it, but the ones like way over here, because we still got a lot of people congregating at the fire. Huh. Or maybe, for some reason, and we got people congregating all the way the hell over here. Huh. Worrisome. Maybe, maybe my people just aren't drinkers. The heretics. <laughs> There we go, and a fancy barn. And chartreuse, so can you have more than one tavern? Oh, yeah, yeah, we definitely could. You can have as many buildings as you want, so long as you don't reach your building limit. Which, wow, we're actually close. I've never come this close. So this is the most buildings I've ever had in this game. So our building limit is 70. And we've made 50. Jesus, we've made 50 buildings. <laughs> Damn. All right. Well, let's put up these planks and go to bed. Okay. 
<laughs> Before I go to bed, I should actually probably, yeah. Because now that we're also using water buckets at the tavern for making mead, I gotta make sure we, uh... Got plenty of buckets of water in here. Okay. All right. Wonderful. Put those in food storage and then to bed. Hello, sir. How are you? Grabbing a late night snack? No? <laughs> Ooh, boy. Yeah, we actually didn't need the water. I mean, we've still got, you know, 13, but nonetheless. Bucket. Bucket. It starts with a B. <laughs> there we go. Get my torch out and head on home. Yeah. And magnificent. The wife is already asleep. Don't want to shine a torch in her face. <laughs> All right. Beautiful. And sci-fi, yes, we do have a couple of hops. <laughs> I actually don't think we've gained any hops yet from them because I think uh, they haven't matured yet. Uh, were they going here or in the other building? I know we have some. Yeah, these are just one hops we've found in the wild. Well, is there any? I don't think there are any food. I don't think that that has matured yet. So it takes a while. Yep. No, nope, we don't. We don't got any. I mean, we could make some. You yeah, know, we could make some pear and plum juice. <laughs> we got plenty of pears and plums. See, so yeah, the hops haven't matured quite yet. Dang. Oh yeah, I gotta put the person back into the barn. I always forget that it always kicks them out when they're done with the upgrade. There we go. Uh, you know what? No, yeah, no. We'll put you back in here. There we go. Now I actually am gonna go help with farming because we only have one person working the farmlands right now, and I need someone to keep making fertilizer and all that. I'ma go collect cabbages. Yeah, they've done a good job collecting that stuff so far. Good, 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 good. Let's do some farming ourselves. I mean, we planted these cabbages. Might as well uh, pick them, too, this season. Nice. I'm going to get so over-encumbered with cabbages. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, look at all them cabbages we're getting. Excellent. While our other person takes care of the flax, so we can have plenty of linen. And this will be able to make food. Magnificent. Alright. Keep it going. Keep it going. Final bro. And of course, I'm caring too much. <laughs> We may need to call the horse. Yeah, we're still able to move right now. I think we'll be fine. Ooh, we're getting close to the edge, though. We're getting close to the edge. We're good. We're good. There we are. All done. All done. And chartreuse. What the heck is the maturation cycle? Three for hops in this game. And how many should you plant? Well, I've only got three because I mainly have them for decorative. Still, vineyards have been around for ages. They need them in this game. I agree. I, I've been saying that for ages, too. I mean, if we can... All the different things we can grow, we can definitely grow hops in this environment, too. Or not hops. Uh, grow vines. Sad we don't have grapes. Oh, well. There's all that. All those delicious cabbages. 372! That'll get us to next season when all of the fields will be cabbage. Nice. All right, yeah, nothing else I had to go in there. Seeds will go back in storage. Excellent. I need to eat some of my food. You know what? Finally eat a meat pie. There we go. That was way more than I needed. <laughs> in sci-fi, cabbages are like footballs. If you drop them, they would roll down the hill. I mean, yeah, a lot of things do that more than just footballs. <laughs> But, okay. Okay. Now, out of curiosity, how far are we from this? Uh, quite a ways still. Do I care? Hmm. 
fishing hut almost. We're getting there on that one. Yeah, I kind of want to have all the buildings now. <laughs> oh, I was so close to giving up on our save file here a while back, and but now that we now that we're getting more tech gain, I kind of want to wait. So yeah, we almost got these things. That one's gonna be one's gonna, one that's gonna need the longest wait, unfortunately. Hmm. Well, just do flower things for both of those. Sad. Anything new with the fishing hunt when we get that? Ooh, a Winsent trophy. We would need a Winsent skull, though. Ooh, bear rug. Heck yeah. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, well. Okay, so... I'm still debating on if I should put the cow shed back here. I mean, we probably could make it fit, but mm, I don't know. Actually, could it fit, like, right here? I don't think so. I think it's going to be too big. Yeah, it's too big. That won't fit there. Nah. I mean, we, uh, if we really squeeze it in, maybe. But no, I think the tavern is too big of a building. I don't think we're going to be able to fit it there. Even if we did take out those two trees, I don't think it would fit. It's like the one thing we could do is like that, but I don't know. I don't know. Because again, the cow shed is pretty big. I mean, I could always, yeah, if I, yeah, I'll definitely have to, if I want to build it, I'm going to have to take out those trees. And we put it at an angle here with that building, maybe, uh, or with not the, with the building, with the walls. Maybe... Hmm. And Chartreuse, yeah, yeah, I know. With the boosted stats, it's not going to take us too much longer, but still. Yeah, I don't know if I would even like it here anymore now. Well, you know what? Hmm. 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 Maybe here. That might... Oh, uh, no, 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 I don't think it would. I don't think it would. Because, yeah, we have that corner of the building here. The wall's over there. And, yeah, we don't have enough room with the building right here. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. And you know what? I kind of want to keep these trees here. I don't want to... I don't want to destroy these trees... Only to then not be able to build the cow shed and go, son of a... <laughs> <laughs> and yeah, we could move the perimeter out a bit, but I don't want to do that either. I think we might just... Move... You know what I'm thinking we might do? Move the cow shed again, but keep it out here. Just move it back and build a fence out here. Then maybe even get a couple more cows to make more milk. Huh. Yeah. Like, I'm thinking we build it yeah, like, just like right here. <laughs> True stealth. Right now we have free range cow. But, meh. I would like to have a fence out here for him. You know, keep him safe. Yeah, I kind of think we do that then. I, I should have done that in the first place, honestly. I, I built it by the road because I thought it would be temporary. But with the, the tavern is much wider than I anticipated. And so, yeah, I don't think we're going to be able to fit anything back here, realistically. But we can do... And... Come on. There we go. <laughs> Gonna be kind of a screwy fence now, but I actually kind of like the screwy fence if we bring it back this... Ooh, no. Uh, uh, well, well, well uh, you know, that's, yeah, that's not bad. Your planks. Oh, dang. <laughs> I need more planks. And yeah, maybe we add some more tables back here. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I like it now. I like it now. Oh, God, I'm gonna need four, eight, six, eight, three, four. 
Too many. Too many things. <laughs> well, let's gather all these eggs and feathers. And, uh, yeah. I actually think that's going to be a good place for me to end it then today. I will tend to the chickens now that I don't have someone in here, sadly. Uh, and next time we'll work on decorating the tavern. Figure out where to put... Because I do want to build the um, construction building, but I don't know where I want to put that. Actually, you know what? I think it might go good since we do have that hole right back there. That might go well there. Hmm. Interesting. But that's going to be it for this one today. Hopefully you all have enjoyed and you do come back for the next one. But until that time, a thank you for watching. And as always, we'll have a good one.